Hi friends, I am starting an experiment growing stevia in Aero Garden. Based on my reading so far, stevia is a really hard to grow plant. Germination is also pretty challenging. Even on the package, it says that germination takes 7 to 21 days. Stevia seeds are extremely small. What I got here are the palleted seeds. That means the seeds are coated with something. You can see how tiny the seeds are. Some of the seeds lost the coating so I can see them. They are really hair thin. Anyway, I'm going to use the seeds without coating as well as the seeds in coating. Since the germination rate is super low, I'm going to drop about four seeds in each pod and uh, give it a try. Okay, first I'm dropping the seeds without coating. Okay, three seeds in this pod. All right. Okay, second one. I'm going to try four seeds in this. The last one. One, two, three, and four. So I'm starting with only four pods. We'll see how this experiment goes. If I'm lucky, these four plants are well enough for me. Right, just make sure you're pressing harder so no light goes inside and no algae. My garden is pretty much ready with four pods. I'm going to cover these uh, empty holes and uh, start the garden. It's been 15 days. I see they sprouted well, but they are not really growing anymore. But at least they are not dying, so I will continue to monitor this. Okay, it's been 21 days. I see the real leaves on all the plants. They are coming up very nice. I think the seeds without the pellet did not come. So this is pretty much gone. I am going to remove this today. But I am getting three plants coming up very nice. It's been 34 days. These stevia plants are picking up the growth very well. I see one plant put a lot of pretty good leaves. This plant is also doing pretty nice. Pretty good leaves. This plant is picking up the growth. Leaves are not that big but uh, I think it's better than uh, two weeks ago. So overall I think these stevia plants are doing very well. It's time for taste test. I have my daughters here for taste test. I'm going to pick the biggest leaf. There it is. Alright, you can go and taste it. Mm, it's like candy. It's like candy? Yeah, wow. it's better than all my candies. It's better like my candy. Wow, it's very, very sweet. It's so yummy and so sweet. We can't really stop here. We really need one more leaf. Right here is one more. Wow. This is the first sweet leaf I ever ate. It's day 38. Look at these leaves. These are really big. This leaf is one and a half inch tall and one inch wide. The fresh new leaves are also pretty good. They are about like one inch tall. The plants are doing really nice. Let's check this plant. The leaves are pretty green and thick. And it is putting lot of leaves. The third plant also doing good. Lot of thick and green leaves. Wow, this is really nice. These leaves now became our everyday dessert. It's been 44 days. Look at these stevia bushes with gigantic leaves. All three plants are doing excellent. I'm going to harvest three leaves and show you the dimensions. Look at these small branches coming from all over. Same thing, every plant is putting lot of new branches. Ok, 
okay it is nearly 3 inches long and 2 inches wide same thing with other two leaves it's actually more than 3 inches long this one is also 3 inches 2 inches and 2 inches wow pretty nice leaves it's been 48 days I see a lot of pretty good leaves it's time to harvest some of these leaves, dehydrate and try it in my tea. Look at this huge pile of leaves. It's time to dehydrate them. I'm going to first wash these leaves. I washed my leaves. I'm just going to spread it to pad them very well to take off all this water. I removed all the water. Now I'm going to put them in my air fryer pan. I'm placing this stand so that the leaves don't fly out. Now I'm going to place it in my air fryer. I'm starting at 200 degree Fahrenheit. I'm going to keep checking every one minute and uh, continue to run it until it completely dries out. It's been three minutes. Looks like they are already dry. Not quite. They are getting close to dry. I think they need one more minute. I'll put it back. Alright, the stevia is dehydrated now. Let me taste one of these dehydrated pieces to see if I lost any sweetness. Not much. I still feel the same sweetness. It's time to make tea. To make the tea, I'm adding a cup of milk. Turn on the stove. I'm going to let this milk boil for a minute or two. Milk is boiling. Now I'm adding one spoon of black tea. Then I'm going to add some stevia instead of white sugar. I'm going to boil this for 3 to 5 minutes. Tea is ready now. Filtering my tea. Here is my first ever tea made with stevia leaves. Let me taste it. It's slightly different uh, taste compared to my tea made with uh, white sugar. But it's pretty good. Very nice.